ridiculous. Thank Fair you enough. very much for that. Yes, ridiculous, ridiculous. Andrew was saying. Very funny, but I think ridiculous. It's nice. Right, now, what are we talking about this morning? Well, lots and lots to talk about this morning, particularly the issue of uh, wearing sunglasses for, on, for kids. We're going to be talking to an optometrist mm -hmm. in a few minutes' time because there's new research out today that's suggesting that many uh, parents don't realise, I think actually three-quarters of parents don't realise that their children must wear sunglasses. It's actually very, very important. Hi there, welcome back. Very good morning to you. Now, as we were saying a short while ago, we had a huge response to our story on the cost of school uniforms yesterday. We're putting some of your comments of the schools minister in right in the Remember, all of these washed 15 times, blue shirt, pretty uh, ordinary. And then this uh, grey jumper is also looking okay, a little bit baggy. All in all, uh, our uniforms haven't done too badly. Now, as we said, we've got about 2,000 text messages and emails yesterday about the cost of school uniform. Many of you finding it really expensive. Uh, this one from Louise in Carlisle. Now she said, my daughter is starting. Uh, by far the most popular comment though was about the idea of school logos and Elaine in Dunblane has been in touch. Hi there Elaine. And she says, it's uh, far cheaper than option, isn't it? Uh, to end on a positive note though, this text came in. Uh, it says, my daughter's school has just changed from an academy and now they receive new uniforms for free. Their old uniforms also being recycled and sent to Ghana, which is pretty good, isn't it? I also just want to introduce Andrew to this contraption. It's called the Iron and Andrew told me before we came on air there you go I'm it's called an iron and you use it to make your shirts nice and there but there you go <laughs> I'm going to brand you with it for being naughty <laughs> oh that's not very nice <laughs> uh, still to come this morning here on GMTV Girl About Town